wanted to share with you a charm bracelet that I recently got. I feel like this type of charm bracelet has become a lot more popular. I feel like almost every jewelry store has some sort of type of charm bracelet like this. I know that back in the day charm bracelets were the chain link bracelets that you had the danglies and now they have this type of charm bracelet, the ones with um, the beads that you put on and I just think it is such a great idea especially for people who are hard to shop for or for mom, sisters, any type of person because then you know you can start off with just a bracelet and then every event like birthday, anniversary, like monumental time in their life you can get them a charm so they can remember that time and these ones are from soul feel and what i love is that they put in the package a gift bag so that if you're gifting this you can um, send it to them or give it to them in this and then it comes in this beautiful jewelry box with like a mint ribbon um, and then it also comes with a little envelope with a silver polishing cloth which is really nice and handy so I really like this. I'm going to link it down below. When you go to the website, everything is shown in pounds, but they do ship internationally and you can pay with PayPal or a credit card or whatever. So even though it's not in US dollars, you can um, purchase them. And all of the charms and everything, everything's quite reasonably priced. It's very similar to um, anything that you're going to see at a jewelry store um, or anywhere else online. And everything is real. Like these are real silver. There's some with like gold pieces, which are obviously a little bit more expensive. So anyways, I am going to show you guys the bracelet that I got. I um, wasn't sure what size bracelet to get because I'm not a, a petite person. Some girls have really teeny tiny wrists. I'm 5 foot 10 and I'm just like average size for my height. So I did get the 21 centimeter bracelet and see I can slip it over my wrist and it goes really far down so I actually have a 19 centimeter one on the way so that I can switch out the charms and put it on that one and wear it without it worrying about it falling off and I actually worried about I was like how do the beads not fall off when you take it off but this part right here it looks like it's just the design but it's actually a spiral like um, a screw and each bead inside is a spiral as well so it's not going to fall off when you open it um, you have to twist it in order for the charm to come off and then the clasp is this little I've never seen a clasp like this before it's like a little circle and then when you pull it out there's like a little thing it looks almost like a pin top and then it fits inside the groove and then the clasp clips on around it and so it's very very secure so it's not going to go anywhere so I'm going to show you guys the charms that I got and I hope you guys like this. If you guys are a collector of one of these charm bracelets, I would love to see pictures of your bracelet um, and get some ideas. So I'm really excited because now my husband doesn't um, have to search endlessly for something he's not sure if I'm going to like or not, like, you know, for birthdays or Christmas or whatever, I can always just get a charm to add on to my bracelet and I also love that you can um, take off charms or add charms depending on the season or occasion or color and I don't mind it moving around like this when it's not full of charms but if you do mind it moving around you can actually get charms that are stoppers that will keep the charms in place uh, before your bracelet is totally full but I actually think this because I like the bracelet itself, I actually think it would be cute even if it just has like one charm on it. So I really like the versatility of this too. And they're very high quality. So this is, I mean, it's not a cheap present by any means, but if you're just buying one piece at a time, it's very um, doable, you know? Like if you're, if you're going to buy one charm for like $35 or, you know, all the charms vary in, in price, but you know, for each special occasion, you're probably gonna spend that much anyways on whoever you're buying it for. So anyways, I'm going to show you my charms now. And I'm sorry that it doesn't autofocus, but um, I'm gonna have really crisp up close pictures of it on my blog. So if you wanna see them close up, please go there and I will link that. And I have to say that the charms look a lot better in real life. When I was on their website looking at all the charms, I wasn't sure how they were going to look, but they look very, very high quality. And I do think that even though there's different brands of these charm bracelets, I think that the charms are all universal in size because a couple of the reviews I read um, said that people had bought charms for their mom's like Pandora bracelet or I forget the other names of the companies. But So you can buy these charms for 
um, if your mom or whoever you're buying this for already has a charm bracelet. So, and you can always buy like different bands too. Like there's leather bands, there's tons of different ones. So check out their website. And I really like that um, they have charms that I haven't seen in other places. So, you know, you're going to get ones that are kind of unique and different. So anyways, here are the charms that I got on mine. So the first bead is not so meaningful. I really just picked it because I thought it was pretty. <laughs> But this one is silver with blue and green leaves and then there's little um, clear crystals that go around. The next one is a heart that says mom on it because I'm a mommy. And then the next one is also, I just chose it because it was really pretty, it's a glass bead with um, white flowers and this is blue and green. I thought it matched this one really good. And then the center has silver. And then this one is a little acorn and this one reminded me a lot of my grandmother who recently passed away and I was very close with her and I used to go on walks with my grandma and we would pick acorns off of the ground and then when I would get home she would use the um, the nut for things but I remember like pulling off the tops of the acorn and they look like little hats. So this little acorn just kind of reminded me of her so I wanted that one. This one is a nest little bird's nest with three little pearls inside of it and I chose this one because I have three kids so they are my little eggs in my nest. The next one is a little house with hearts kind of floating like off of the roof and I like this one because I feel like I have lots of love in my home and I want to remember that that's my priority to keep the love in my home and I want it to be like a joyful, happy place. Also for people who come to our house, I want them to always feel loved by us. Okay, the next one is a heart charm. And this one I also picked just because I thought it was so pretty. It's a dangly heart. And then there's like a gold design up here. And the stones in the heart are yellow because I was born in November. And that is my birthstone is the yellow topaz. And also two of my kids were born in November too. And then... This one, it seems funny, it's a little piggy, and my husband was like, oh, you're going to get a pig to represent me? But he was born in the year of the pig, um, so that's why I chose the pig, and I thought it was really cute, so it's not for any other reason. And this pig is really cute, I don't know if you can see, so blurry. So the next little charm I thought was so cute, it is, this is going to be a good reminder to me too, it's a little egg, it's a shiny silver egg and there's a gold crown on top and you know to other people it might just be like an egg with a crown but this made me think of like when you are an egg in your mother's womb even before you're born and even before you are who you are you know God has already called you to be someone and um, it reminded me of that verse where it says I knit you together in your mother's womb so even before I was born I was already God's princess and I was already you know, created to be something and um, I was already royalty so I like that little egg with the crown. And then the last bead is this um, flower and I thought it was really pretty and it kind of reminded me of the flower on my shoulder. If you guys want to see why that flower is important to me, that is in my tattoo video. So if you were to just start off with just the bracelet, it's actually a really pretty bracelet because it's um, kind of that bold silver so you could wear it just like that. And then, um, you know, other people can get that person charms too. So um, it, I feel like it kind of helps out for all those special holidays and you know, days that you want to remember. So I'm really excited to keep collecting them. And I love that you can take off certain ones too and add other ones and you can wear different ones at different times. So this, I will link the website and the people there at this company are super, super nice too. And I feel like that makes a big difference to when I'm buying stuff from somewhere because I don't know when people are kind of like mean, like customer service people, I don't want to deal with them like you know I don't know I feel like if they're nicer I want to support their business so anyways most of these charms too I well not most of them all of them besides like the glass beads I don't know if the the glass beads they have anywhere else but all of these charms I haven't seen anywhere else so it's kind of neat too that you can find charms from different places and 
um, no one else will have the charms you have because each bracelet is unique too. So, so if you have any of these sort of charm bracelets, I would love to see your charms too. So um, yeah, so check out my blog and I will have really good pictures of these charms and I hope that you like them. I hope this helps you with ideas for your loved ones and your family too. So anyways, I'll talk to you later. Bye.